Hey everybody out there in Poke Land. All right. Um, yeah, today we're going to do a uh, Bob opening. Yes, uh, anybody out there ever heard of Control Out Bob? He's my favorite PokeTuber. I uh, watch his channel religiously every week. Uh, he's changing up things a little bit. Uh, coming up soon, he's going to be doing more uh, content videos rather than live streams. But uh, I'll miss him in that category. But uh, today is... Well, one of my favorite times of all time is that's receiving some mail. It's from Control Alt Bob. Anyway, I'm going to open this up. There's a, some special stuff in this one, and it's going to be a fun opening, I tell you. Okay, all right, let's get into it. All right. We have a, quite a bit in here. All right. Okay, let's get into it. Now, I... Do you know for a fact that this one is going to be a fun one to open? Okay, those have Bob mystery packs in them. And these are my favorite mystery packs to buy of all time because Bob is more than fair. His, these are Waifu and Gaifu mystery packs. I got two of them. All right, but we're going to save those for the end. All right. Let's see here. All right. Doop, doop, oh. I'm going to tell already because this one says 83 cents that this is a pack that I won off a of pack battle off his channel. I do win one every now and then. And it's a lot of fun. Okay, so this was a giveaway. Let's see here. We have the secret box. And to the... I can't even read that. Wellspring Ogre Pond. Wellspring Ogre Pond. Uh, oh, Frogadier. All right. I'll just flip through these and then bring up the good ones. We got the Mabu Stiff EX. Uh, oh, this Mabu Stiff. And the rest are reverse cards. Okay, all right, that one wasn't the most exciting, but I'm all right with that. Okay, I take the one, the good ones, put them up there. Okay, let's get into order 1688. Okay, all right. Oh, oh, oh. This one must have been a bad one because I can tell already it's got a pity pull. We've got a Charizard. Charizard EX, my favorite guy. I'm never disappointed. This was obviously something that Bob put in there because I opened nothing. And, yep. Do, 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 do. And inside there, yep, was exactly that. Nothing. Arr! That's okay. Sometimes you get nothing. All right. Oh, this one's kind of rather thick. Let's open this baby up. This must have been the one where I was buying some, I'm guessing, uh, Celebrations. I brought up, bought a couple of Celebrations tins one show. All right. Yep, it is, too, because I've got the Professor's Research there. We got the Happy Birthday Pikachu, which is a pretty decent card. Yeah. And then... Uh, We've got the Flying Pikachu, which does, in my opinion, still deserve a sleepy. i got to hold these cards up a little higher for you guys now. I'm using a new tripod. Using a new tripod. Pod, pod, pad, pod. I can talk. And it's a bit up higher, right? I'm not looking at my nose. Like last time, last time, last time I watched my videos, I was looking at my nose and I didn't like it. <laughs> All right, we're going to get to order 1729. Oh, yeah, we're going to get to it. We're going to get to it. There's a very special order in here. If anybody, you want, any of you watch Bob's channel, you know exactly what order I'm looking for. But hopefully we can uh, time it till it's last. I didn't keep track of what order number it was. All right, next one. Oh, 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 this, 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 this might be. No, that's probably not it. Okay, 
we have oh, is this it's not even in a sleeve that is weird bob why isn't this in a sleeve this is a really good card this is uh this was out of a waifu pack it, oh, let's try to get a good focus on that it's the winona yeah, that one where it's i believe over forty dollars on tcg republic or not not tcg republic tcg player all right we got that i'm gonna have to pause the video because i am out of top loaders and this one definitely deserves a top loader give me half a second well it's not even half a second to you <laughs> i gotta stop opening these things in the morning i'm tired i even forgot to bring out my my go go juice mm. Mm. cherry cola all right we got to get this waifu. Wynona. Wynona? Wynona? Wynona. 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 I can talk. I really can. Why am I having trouble with that name? And we, we got that beautiful card right there. Wynona. All right. Okay, we'll put that up there. And we will continue on with this unsleeved bob. Uh oh. Okay, we have the Radiant Jirachi. Not sure if I have that one or not. I'm pretty sure I got all the Radiant cards out there as I did collect them. But I'm there. I think there was one or two that I was missing. Oh, anyway, if I don't, I've got it doubles. I don't mind that at all. Alright, uh, we are still in the search on that pack. Alright, reverses, 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 oh, 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 this must be still coming out of the waifu gaifu packs. Another one without a sleeve, it's unlike Bob to tell you the truth. He was doing quite a bit that day, so we will forgive the man for this time being. I'm not sure if Karina's Focus needs a top loader, but I'll check that later. I'm pretty sure it's on the border of being a 4 or $5 card, but we shall see. Uh, we've got oh the Aroma Lady. Not bad. That was all all these courtesy of the waifu gaifu packs. And you'll get to get to see two more of those. This this was this both of this was uh, all of this was out of two two packs. They were uh eighteen dollars a piece Canadian. I'm not sure what that oh we have a MU V. Oh, there we are. And there is a professor's research and some reverses. And we've got that one covered. All right, we still have a few more to go. Still looking for that one important one card, which I don't see yet. Oh, getting nervous. Okay. I'll never forget Bob pulling this card, to tell you the truth. All right. Oh, we are. Okay. Oh, I think I. F okay, it's not in there. It was with this pack. Where is it, Bob? <laughs> I'm getting really nervous. All right. Right there is the ogre pond. All right. That, that actually deserves a top loader, I believe, because it is a SIR card. I pulled this in the, I believe, the same day as I pulled the other fan. Oh, that's already in this. Ah! I truly am sleepy. Okay. I just double sleeved it. No, I don't need to double sleeve it. I need to put it in a top loader. Okay. All right. Yeah, I was too excited to get some more sleep when I checked the mail. I've been super excited to check the mail. There we go. Heart Flame, 
Ogre Pond. EX. Okay, alright, we're gonna look inside here again to see if that other card is in here floating around because I do not see it. I'm hoping that maybe it might be. Okay, oh good, 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 good. It's, it's in here, it's in here. <laughs> okay, we are definitely saving the best for last. Okay. Alright, we got order two, 1676, uh, oh. Karen's Care, Charon's Care, Charon's Care, I don't think that was part of the Waifu Gaifu, I think that was just a, a pull, alright, and we got the Zamazenta V, Full Arts, alright, and the rest are not okay we got one left before we get to the good 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 pack and the bob mystery packs so i'm going to change the camera angle to one of uh the uh, downward position uh to to reveal this really good pack here because i i want to have a no no i I don't know. We'll just keep it this way, but I'll, I'll try to do it nice. Okay, this one, this one has a top loader, so this one might be the good one too. I'm not sure. Oh, oh, okay. Yes, this, this is definitely, definitely the good one. I thought it was in here because, no, no. Okay, here we go. Seventeen oh nine. Okay, we've got Yogi. Do Let's move along, moving along. Here we are. Oh. Okay, so for this this order here, I uh, ordered five, five Twilight Masquerade. And uh, I hit an A spec. Nothing else. But in the middle, in the middle, uh, in the middle pack, Bob pulled me this baby. And I'll never forget it. Bob's reaction was priceless, and here it is. Pump, bum, bum, bum. This is probably the most expensive card I have pulled, like, that's naked. And uh, I can't believe it's in my hands right now. This is my boy, the Greninja. I was on the fence as to which Pokemon I wanted to choose as my favorite Pokemon. And uh, as you know, I love Charizard. Charizard is my favorite. He's my boy. But uh, I, I chose to choose uh, to collect Charizards, not because he was my favorite Pokemon, just because it's a valued card. Everybody loves him and stuff like that. So um, I decided to focus on uh, collecting valuable cards. And I do like Charizard. But um, anyway, I always was fond of frogs as a kid. I used to go up and catch them all the time. You couldn't stop me from swimming in the ponds and, you know, getting leeches and on my body to just to go catch frogs and stuff like that and uh, I didn't catch them to harm them anything they weren't my buddies and uh, I happened to have a, a a love for ninjas back in the day you know the Shokasuji ninja movies were my favorite when I was a kid and uh, yeah so he's a frog he's a ninja this is the so far the number one chase card out of the Scarlet and Violet era so far whether or not there'll be another one that's worth more will be determined. I did hear a rumor that uh, in the Scarlet and Violet era, we are might see another Evolving Skies type uh, uh, set come out that might have another uh, Evolutions that uh, w might top this card. But for now, the Greninja is growing in value, and uh, I'm super stoked to have this one. And when it comes to uh, card party, Pacific Northwest, I'm going to drag this card with me and have it graded. As Bob said, it was a little, little heavy over here. But not by much. It, it could be PSA forgiven just because of the, the proper card. Although I don't know if they're more stringent on super rare cards like this. But uh, I also got to admit too that um, when I saw this card pulled, I had never seen it pulled on any live stream whatsoever. I uh, somehow just missed them on a few of my favorite channels that when they pulled it, but uh, this was the first one I ever seen get pulled, uh, and the reaction that Bob had when pulling it, 
I like I nearly popped when he pulled it. Um, absolutely love it. Glad it's in my hot little hands right now. It's a, easily one of my favorite cards that I've ever gotten out of Pokemon. So uh, this one ranks up there with the one of my first pulls was which was the Gengar, uh, and uh, this actually supersedes it. So very very cool card. I'm super happy that I have it. All right. Uh, just make sure we didn't miss any of the cards. No, that was it. All we got was the Aspect uh, Secret Box and uh, the Greninja. Okay, so into the sealed Waifu Gaifu packs. Okay, and uh, normally uh, Bob just does random packs. His wife makes up different packs and stuff like that. But this last time he decided to do a more expensive version. So usually it was uh, somewhere in between eight to ten dollars for a mystery pack that Bob sells, and uh, they're one of my favorites. I was kind of a little bit disappointed when I got and I saw that these ones were eighteen dollars a piece. Uh, I would say about what thirteen, fourteen dollars American, uh, and uh, so anyway, let's get into these ones, shall we? All right, this here, all right, is. Pack number one. Now, as far as I know, there was a lily. The I believe the most expensive lily. The lily is the most expensive waifu or daifu card you can get in the Pokemon TCG. Uh, and uh, there apparently was one of those in here. Also, the uh, Iono. The Iono was the other big chase card. And out of the 80 or so packs that uh, were made... There was that none of these cards have been pulled yet, but a lot of people ordered their stuff sealed, so we don't know what's out there. But let's hope that the Iono or the, uh, the the especially the Lily is in this pack because that would just floor me right now because of the luck I've been having lately, uh, you know, uh, pulling uh, various different uh, cards and stuff like that. So let's rip this sucker open. Oh, I'm excited. I love Bob packs. I can't wait for his next batch. I'm probably one of his top customers when it comes to buying Bob packs. All right, this, this is a different angle that I'm used to. I'm gonna bring her down just a touch. There we go, that might be better. Okay. I should have done that at the beginning of the Peko. Unsparse. It's a Fergalator. I like the. I, I swear to God, that's what I thought his name was, Fergalator, but it is Fur Alligator. All right, but I like I, I like Fur Alligator. He's a cool Pokemon. Mister Mime. Now everybody gives Mister Mime a hard time in the Pokeverse, and I'm not sure why. I really like Mister Mime. When I started, I, I when I first got introduced to Pokemon and all its characters, I was playing Pokemon Go with my daughter and. Uh, Mr. Mime was actually my chase guy. I, I all I really wanted to find one. It took me three years before I finally caught one. I did trade for one. And it, he just didn't seem right. But when I actually finally did catch one, I, I loved it. So I will always have a bit of a soft spot in my uh, in my heart. Oh, okay. Is this our first hit? Ooh, ooh, oh, yeah. Is it Gardevoir? Gardevoir. Uh, wouldn't really consider Gardevoir a, a, a waifu. But kind of feminine. Oh, here we go. We have the... What, what is her? Grusha. Grusha? Grusha? She might be Grusha. I guess she looks like she's in Russia. She looks cold. Maybe they're that or she's got... Um, uh, <laughs> Greninja's tongue wrapped around her head. <laughs> All right. And we have Serena, a Serena. These need sleeves, so I will take my time to sleeve them after. Oh, and that is it. That's the last card. Serena is that one. So we got, how many did we get there? Three hits, three hits. We got the, the Grusha. We got the Gardevoir. And the Serena. Which I'm not sure of the value. I'm going to have fun checking out the values after this. All right. Of all these cards, one of my favorite things is to look up the values of the cards. All right. 
Let's leave up the Gardevoir EX. What is the Gardevoir? What kind of creature is she? I don't know. It's one of those Pokemon that I never associated with any actual living animal on Earth. Yeah. I don't know which one might be valid, more valuable, but I, I do like that Grusha card. If I'm saying it wrong, and you call her Grusha, I don't know. Grusha? Grusha. Grusha? Grusha. All right. Cool. We got one left. Still looking for that lily. Oh, man. Can you match it? <laughs> oh, man. Well, whoever gets the lily, congratulations. Especially if you're watching this video. I'm jealous. But it could be me, and I'm jealous of nothing. <laughs> Look what Bob got me. <laughs> it's Tangela. Tangela. Tang I call it. I, I say Tangela. Tangela. All right. We got Tangela. We got uh, Timber. What the heck is that? Oh, Paula Sand. We got a fairy. And pump. And top. We got a boss's orders. Oh, into a T tar. I like T tar. T tar is good. Yeah. He, he he doesn't get as much exposure in the TCG as he should. I mean, they should they should give him another really good card. I think the last time he got a super good card was when he had the. Um, um, uh, sleeping T-Tar. There we go. All right. That guy needs a sleeve. Ooh, what do we have here? Oh, this, look, this looks important. Oh, does it have texture? It's got texture. Eternatus V. Oh, okay. It's, it is, a, I'm guessing that's a trainer gallery, Eternatus V. And this is a guy food pack because it has a guy. Uh, don't know his name. I'm, I'm bad with the names of the trainers. I never pay attention to them. Okay, and the next card. And we got the cook. The cook. Okay. All right. I'm going to pause this and then look up the value of these these trainer these uh, trainer cards. We didn't get the Lily or the Iono, so whoever got that, congratulations. Uh, these are sold out. They sold out, like, I think the very same day. When I bought my last two packs, there was only, like, five or six packs left on the on the site so i do know these are sold out so i'm gonna throw that one up there and uh, i will go and look these cards up on tcg uh, player and see if any of them actually might need a uh, a top loader okay there we are. Oh, oh, oh. Can't forget. My T-Tar needs a sleeve. All right. That was fun. That was absolute fun. Okay. Let me go find out those values, and I will be right back. Uh, tilt this up a little bit more. And hit pause. I'm back. It's not with the greatest of news. Okay. Well, when I thought this, this, I do like this card, the Eternatus V. Uh, it's only a couple of dollar card, but uh, still fun card. And uh, the cook is worth about a dollar. He must not be a very good cook. <laughs> He's no pizza daddy. All right. And uh, the, the, the Grusha or Grusha is worth about two bucks. And the only one worthy of a top loader that I got out of the two uh, Bob mystery packs was the Serena card. Uh, it's just over $10 for her. However... <laughs> While I was there on TCG, I I, I had to uh, almost did that again. Almost re-sleeved the Serena card. I don't know. I need a top loader for her. Yeah. So like for me, that's what makes me decide. So if anything on TGC Republic or TCG Player is worth over five dollars American, it goes into a top loader. There we are. Oh yeah, I believe. That happy birthday Pikachu definitely deserves one as well. 
Huh? And I believe that is a fairly decent valued card. Uh, also, my boy, Charizard. Yeah. Charizard, on the other hand, it doesn't matter if it's a $2 card, a $1 card, a 25 cent card. Every Charizard at the Rattleshark compound gets a top loader. There we are. And throw that Pikachu there. Ah, yes. Oh, yeah. I, I got distracted there. Ooh, that one's got a really cool uh, Pikachu sleeve on it, too. I like that. Okay. Anyway, my boy, the Greninja. I checked the value on that one. This thing keeps on skyrocketing. Today was the first time I seen it. It is up over $300 American now. And now in Canadian terms, that's even more money to me because it's a over $400 card right here. And I hope it keeps trending the way of the snow bunny. No, not snow bunny. The moon bunny. The moon brion from Evolving Skies. Uh, uh, that card, uh, the VMAX, is uh, just, uh, again, just going um, through the roof and stuff like that. Makes me wish I would have grabbed one when they were sitting around 300 bucks, But uh, I couldn't justify paying 300 bucks for a card back in the day. Let's try, try as I did, I did not get a chance to pull any alt arts from... Uh, uh, from Evolving Skies. Uh, they are quite elusive. Um, there's 17 of them. But uh, anyway, this is definitely my favorite card in my collection that I ever got to pull. Thanks, Bob, for uh, pulling that live on your channel for me. It will be my one of my greatest uh, memories of when you were doing live uh, uh, rip and ships and stuff like that. Gonna miss the rip and ship store. I'm not gonna lie, but uh, I will uh, definitely support some other uh, channels worthy of it. Uh, Bandits Hideouts, one that I buy from. Another one that I'll be buying from would be uh, Max V Max Plays. Uh, Panda and his wife, uh, uh, Miss Mama V Max, are just awesome. I, I recommend that channel as well. Um, and uh, anyway, we got the Greninja, another noteworthy card, the Ogre Pond. We got another one. Uh, the this is the the second best card on the thing. The Winona, uh, she came out of one of the Waifu Gaifu packs, and she's worth about forty, forty uh, U.S. dollars. And uh, then where was my other one? Uh, and then we'll go with uh, end it off with the Serena. Thank you very much. I uh, love you guys all out there in uh, in in the Pokeverse. Uh, and again, uh, look forward to doing another video for you soon. I'm look, I, I'm receiving another box of 151 in the mail, so I will look forward to that video. Hit that bell, uh, uh, hit that subscribe button, leave a like if you're if you're feeling kind about this video, and uh, do do check out Control Alt Bob. Control Alt Bob. Let me see here if I got any of his stuff sitting around. Yep, there we go. We got I, it was a, one of his 5K keychains. Uh, 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 we got a control alt bob sticker uh, and one of his trainer cards that's signed anyway love bob can't wait to see what kind of content he's going to come out with he's a very creative guy definitely subscribe you're going to see want to see what he has to offer to the pokemon universe and uh see what he's doing next uh, he's one of those uh types of people that will uh, like keep you guessing as to what what's happening next and by the way challenge bob let's uh figure out an etb to do and i want to i want to challenge you to one of your official videos you've been served all right everybody see you later love you peace love happiness